Good morning, Broad Bay Country Club. This is Thomas Pittman, your head golf professional. Welcome to this week's October 21st virtual email. I want to let you all know a little bit about what's going on at the club. Here in the golf shop on Monday, October 26th, the back nine will be closed to allow Keith to do some spraying out on the golf course. Now the rest of the, everybody will let you know what's going on in their departments. Thank you. Hey Broad Bay, Brian Cornell here. Be sure to check out in today's email information about October 23rd's Trunk or Treat as well as our Halloween Member Appreciation Festival. Also, be sure to look for information on the Junior Tennis Clinic as well as the Adult Tennis Mixer. Um, we have information coming up on the virtual email from Brian Liebler regarding our Thanksgiving feast. Um, Keith's got a turf talk and we have a lot of information about a lot of wonderful things happening around the club. See you here soon. Hi, Brian Liebler, General Manager at Broad Bay Country Club. The holidays are quickly approaching. Allow us to take the hassle out of your Thanksgiving. This year, due to the current COVID situation, Broad Bay will be offering you the opportunity to build your own family feast in lieu of our traditional Thanksgiving buffet. Please see below for ordering details. We look forward to seeing you at the club. Hey Broad Bay ladies, it's your favorite, Brianna. I just wanted to invite you guys out for November 5th, 4.30 for our ladies party clinic. It'll happen every month, so stay tuned to the newsletter and I will see you there. The best thing about golf is it's played on the earth. So let's take a break and talk to Keith about turf. Turf Talk. Hello everybody, Keith O'Neill. and Welcome to another edition of Turf Talk. We've been using this format to kind of rehash things we've done on the golf course, how we can make the golf course better, how you can make the golf course better. And earlier this year, I did a demonstration on how to repair a ball mark. Well, I think it's time for a little refresher for you. We're here at the end of August. Our greens are in absolutely sensational shape for this time of year with all the rain we've been having. But yet, that said, when they're soft, we're going to make some ball marks. So what I'd like to do is, for demonstration purposes, is I'm going to take this golf ball and I'm going to throw it into the green to make a, a ball mark and then I'll show you how to repair it. As you see, that ball landed right there and there, that's a pretty nice ball mark. Looks like somebody hit a pretty good shot in here. And here's the biggest mistake everybody makes. They think they can just fold that flap over and it'll be okay. It doesn't work that way. What you need to do is, with your ball mark repair tool that can be purchased in Thomas's Pro Shop, you want to take that flap of turf and dig it up and throw it away. And then you're going to use the ball mark repair tool to insert it from the edges and push inward. And then take the flat part of your putter and just flatten it back out. A little bit of mud, scratch it away, pat it back down, and in a day that's healed. Too many people are making the mistake, and I'll demonstrate on an old one here, where they want to come in and lift up. That's the last thing we want to do, because what happens is my mowers are coming across at 130 thousandths of an inch the next day, and they whack that top right off of there. And that's where you see all that little brown spot of an unrepaired ball mark. It's not that somebody didn't try to repair it, they just didn't repair it properly. Keep those things in mind. Get a ball mark repair tool if you don't have one and it's the easiest way for you all to keep greens quality here at Broad Bay. Thanks, and I'll see you next week. 